to my channel. I want to start this video out today with a few exciting wedding updates. It's currently the beginning of May and our wedding is in June so that's literally in like a month and a bit which is very exciting and we're getting all the like final bits sorted. I got my wedding dress shoes that I want to share with you and I have also been on the hunt for a really good kind of after party dress for the dancing and all of that because my actual wedding dress is so beautiful but it might not be the most comfortable to have like a full-on night of dancing with so I actually ordered a few dresses that are on the way and hopefully one of them is going to work but for my main dress some of you guys might know I'm working with Gali Lahav and I went to Paris back in December and I found a really really beautiful one that's not in that video it's gonna be a surprise but they are currently custom making the dress for me which is so so exciting and we were actually supposed to go and do the final fitting next week but they told me that they're now in lockdown and I don't know when I'll be able to go and do that but hopefully it's gonna be in time for the wedding so I'm really really praying that um, that is all gonna work out but I did get my wedding shoes organized so I got them from Jimmy Choo when I was looking at shoes there are of course so many beautiful styles that are very bridal and just perfectly suited for a wedding dress but for me and my kind of lifestyle I like to have things that I can wear with lots of different things so I didn't want to have shoes that I could only wear with my wedding dress but of course I still wanted something that would look really pretty with a wedding dress and that will complement it really nicely and I think I found just that so these are called the mini 85 and the shade is ballet pink so this is what they look like they are so pretty and super chic and elegant and just really versatile so I think these are going to look so great with a beautiful dress but again I wanted something that I could also wear beyond my wedding day. I can totally see myself wearing these in the summer out to dinner with a nice dress or even with jeans. I think they are very pretty and just very very versatile and of course the color is so pretty as well just a great neutral and yeah they're very comfortable as well so I'm so excited about these I will have them linked down below in the description box if you guys want to check them out another thing I'm very excited about that I want to share with you is my new handbag it is so cute for spring this is the mini Fiore bag by Sunrev it is literally the cutest bucket bag I've ever seen I love the gold details on there and I really like this like shape that it's in so it has this cool design kind of like structure around the bucket bag which I think is very unique and this is actually a little pocket here in the back which I think is really genius for like your phone your keys anything you need just like quick access to and you can wear this as a shoulder bag or as a crossbody I will put it on so you guys can see how it lays on the body but I think it is the perfect size this fits everything that I need so I'm going to show you guys what I keep in here so I've got my vlogging camera my phone my wallet and then I actually like to keep my keys in this little side pocket so you have two pockets here and again that one right here in the back it is also available in two different leathers so this is the Amica pebbled leather I will do a close-up so you guys can see the details but this is such nice quality it feels buttery soft and because it's pebbled you don't have to be too careful with it so if you get like a scratch on it it's not going to be that visible and I feel like all the Sinra bags just have this really great durability and quality to them it does also come in a really nice vegan leather option which is this one right here and this is called the Amica Misto leather Leather. and as you can see from the close-up it has a really nice smooth texture and then it has this really nice croc embossed detailing on the side so it still stays very durable and I think this is equally as pretty it feels really good very high quality this is the walnut shade it does also come in three other colors which I'll put here on the screen but yeah these bags are so cute they're so well made I believe you can use my code Annie for these bags as well that will get you $50 off a $300 or more purchase Purchase. I will double check with them on that and I'll leave the information below in the description box but yeah I think this is so cute and I'm so excited to wear it this spring and summer another very exciting wedding update is that Mo got his suit got it guys and we are now on the way to pick up part of it um, so it's a custom suit yeah. from suit supply if any of you guys are getting married or if your husband's 
boyfriends, fiancés need a good suit, would you recommend? Yeah, it's amazing because they literally, you can decide which fabric you want. Everything is custom and it's not that expensive and they have very good materials and you can custom everything. Every small detail they custom for you. Yeah. And it takes about two weeks or two to three weeks to make the changes and everything else and then they send it to you. I've never actually been to the store. He went with one of his friends for the first appointment. We FaceTimed. Yeah. Um, when he had the suit on and it looked so so nice, but you did also get like a custom shirt Which is the one yeah. we're gonna pick up today exactly. we got, I guess we're gonna pick it up and also put it on because they want to see if everything is right fabric that he chose this is not the exact one that he's going to have just wanted to show you guys what the fabric is gonna be so it's a nice neutral color I like I like I like, like, it. I like the structure you know mm -hmm. you look really nice so which ones did you choose I went I guess I went for these ones those are nice are those the same ones that you have no it's a little bit darker because I wanted to have some contrast mm -hmm. for this one I I chose pearl so mm -hmm. you can also customize these ones. It's and so cool that you can yeah. like, choose every detail. And for the inside, I chose this. Ooh. Just here, not here. I chose, uh, I guess I chose this one. Something like that, or so, or this. Hello you guys, it is the next day. Um, today has actually been a very intense work day. Mo and I have been on our laptops pretty much the whole day. We've been working on some wedding stuff and some things for our brand as well. We are soon launching our cleansing pads, which you guys have probably seen me use in a few of my other videos and on my stories. I'll show you guys what they look like here. So we've been finalizing things for that. They should hopefully be up on our site in the next week or so, so stay tuned. But the weather today has been really miserable <laughs> and it's been like this for the last few days and as much as i try for it to not affect me i really feel it like it has not been sunny in over a week and i love to be outside i love to go on my walks and things like that and just be out in nature and when the weather is like that i just <sighs> but something that always makes me feel good is to have a nice evening routine, a nice wind down routine. I love to have a shower or a bath, get a nice vibe going and have like some scented candles on or use a body wash that smells really good. For me, that just really makes me feel great and kind of refreshes me after a long day and prepares me to have a really nice evening. So I thought I would show you a bit of my evening routine for a day like this when I just really want to make myself feel good, take care of myself, kind of lift my mood and my spirit a little bit after it being like a very gray, rainy, long day. I've just made myself a bath and this looks so so good it smells incredible I love to use bath salts in my bath these are magnesium Epsom salts that I just get on Amazon and I put about three cups of the salt and it's really good for muscle tension it just feels really nice and soothing I also have this one I put in a little bit of this too it's from Earl of East this one is a little bit fancier so I just put a bit of that but mostly this one and then a little bit of this Arnica uh, muscle soak from Weleda. Again, just very soothing and relaxing. A bath must for me is definitely a pillow. I also get this on Amazon. It's a very small thing, but it makes such a difference because I find this alone is just too hard for my neck. And when I have this, I can just lay here very, very comfortably. Here, I love this uh, bath caddy tray. I have a little terry cloth here for exfoliation, and I will also use this dry brush before I get into the bath. I like to take this just up my legs, down my arms, a little bit on my back. Really great for moving the lymphatic system and of course it's a nice exfoliation for the body as well. 
got my candles going it smells so good so i'm gonna enjoy this and i'll see you guys in a little bit getting dinner ready and I'm trying out a new recipe tonight this is a coconut lime chicken dish it smells so good we are so excited to eat this and it's so fresh I've just chopped up a little bit of fresh cilantro I'm gonna put on top and we're gonna have that with some steamed broccoli and then for dessert I'm making us some almond butter chocolate chip cookies because it's all about the balance <laughs> again I will make sure to have the recipe down below in the description box So good. <laughs> you know, I want to tell you one while. story. Annie, so fun. It's so good. It's really so good. <laughs> Thank you, you. You know, sometimes when Annie does things, she's like, I bite and she's, how is it? I'm like, I'm still chewing, you know? <laughs> <laughs> so it's always fun. She's like, what is happening? Tell me. So no, it's really good. But Thank I just you. need time. You know, it needs time till it's like on your taste nerves. How do you? Yeah. No, but it's good. You should let it like yeah. si soak in. Mm, I love it. So we are gonna enjoy now. Are you also gonna make a tea? Yeah. We're gonna have tea, some cookies, and we're gonna watch a movie. So thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one.